Hey, thanks for joining me. I am at Portillo's. It's a Chicago-based hot dog hamburger and sandwich restaurant that is relatively new to the Indianapolis area. I am at the Southside Indy location and I'm gonna tell you what I think of it right now. Hey, welcome to Who's Your Daddy, the channel where we have lots of food and lots of fun. I'm Matthew and I'm here at Portillo's. It's a Chicago-based restaurant that is relatively new here. And I've actually been here once before. I wasn't too terribly impressed the first time, but my wife and her co-workers are having lunch here today. So I thought I would join them and tell you what I think of this place. See if I could give them a second chance, so. Let's go check it out. What did you order? The jumbo chili cheese dog? Yep. And I ordered the Italian beef and sausage with onion rings. And I'm gonna eat some of your onions. That's fine with me. So apparently they're famous for their hot dogs, so that's why you wanted to try it. Yep. That is the original dog house. Apparently they started out just selling hot dogs in 1963. I got the Italian beef and sausage with extra gravy and peppers and a side of onion rings. And there's your chili cheese dog. Let's try out these onion rings. Oh, those are hot. Mm -hmm. Pretty good though. Actually, those are really good. Nice and crispy. Very tasty. I like them. Let's try it. This sandwich. I thought it was too nice. I want to catch up with her boyfriend, but he was already gone. So we went to. Uh, that is really good. I just want to go home and switch cars. But it's I'm impressed. $16 for the two meals. It's not too bad. It's pretty tasty. So this is Randy. What did you get today? And what do you think I of it? I got the uh, beef and cheddar croissant. Cornetto in Italian. Anyway, it was really, really good. I, the last time I was here, I was not very impressed, but this time it's much quieter in here now than it was the first time we came, because we came right after they opened and it was full of noisy people. And now it's nice, the food was good. The fries were even good this time. Beef and cheddar croissant was very good. It was hard time, we had a hard time finding the cheese, but it was there. A plus. All right, thanks. And Crystal, how was your chili cheese dog? <laughs> it was a beef hot dog. Very good. I liked it a lot. Rating out of, out of 10? <laughs> I would probably give it a 7 or an 8. Okay. Very good. All right, so that was really good. I had to come out here because it was kind of loud in there. I don't know how the audio turned out, so I figured I would tell you what I thought about everything out here. The food was surprisingly a lot better than I remember it. I think that the last time I was here, I had just a plain Italian sausage sandwich. There was nothing on it. And today, since I ordered the Italian sausage plus the beef with the sweet and hot peppers and the extra gravy, it made it a lot better. It was really, really good. Totally different experience than last time. I can't believe how amazing it was. So I would strongly encourage you to try this place out. Everything was really good, and I couldn't leave without trying some dessert too. I saw some pictures of it, and it looked really good, so I thought I would get some of the chocolate eclair cake. So check mm, this look out. Look at that. That looks delicious. Mmm. All those layers. Chocolate top. That was only $3. 
So let's see how this is. That is really good. I am impressed. It's got probably three or four layers with chocolate on the top and the crust on the bottom. That is delicious. Mmm. Yeah, that is really, really good. Nice and cold. It's like, like melted ice cream on the inside and on the top. Tastes like, almost like a vanilla custardy filling with like melted chocolate all over the top. Okay, so not too bad for $16 for a sandwich, a chili dog, and onion rings, plus another $3 for the chocolate eclair cake. So about 20 bucks to feed two of us, and I am absolutely stuffed. I'd say that was a pretty good value. Two thumbs up, definitely, on everything. On the sandwiches, the burgers are good too. On the hot dogs, the Italian beef, the Italian sausage, everything was just amazing. So if you ever get a chance to go to Portillo's, if you're in Chicago area or in the Indianapolis area, I'm not sure where else they are, but um, make sure to go ahead and try them out because they were very good. And if you want to leave a comment down below, let me know if you've been to Portillo's or not and what you think of it. That would be really great. Also, you can leave a comment. Let me know any other place I should try out next time because I enjoy doing these restaurant reviews and food reviews. So if there's something you want me to try or taste and give you my opinion, just let me know. Also, don't forget to hit that like button and make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the little notification bell so you don't miss out on any more videos in the future. So thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time.